up, guys? Um, oh, you guys aren't falling for that baggot bullshit, are you? <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, don't don't fall for that. Uh, all right, we got national matches reset, and still gotta finish all the tickets. We still have two. There's two days yet. Two days to get all the matches. I think I'm back up like 35. Is Baggett not a good investment? No, it's a fake. It's it's a scam. It's manufactured investment. Don't know, God no. Chris. I am awake. I am I am pretty much awake. Pretty much. Mostly. Sorta. Kinda. Yeah have because we're leaving this weekend I have one um, last I have one last training before we go you did get Larson yesterday five legendaries 23 no I didn't see it is it on whatsapp I haven't I haven't been on there at all today Why is it not? Why would he not move? That's weird. Log af after a short while. It's, uh, there's times, uh, that FIFA mobile becomes a chore. It's been that way every season. This is one of those times. Got Warlord, then Floor 120 with the Sacred, got Astralon. I did see that you got Astralon. I, uh, I believe I am in range for the Mercy for Sacred, and they have the double legendary thing going on right now. So I'm going to open the three Sacreds that I have. Need to at least do these few here. And see what else has to be done. You pulled a what dwarf? I hate these national matches. The my favorite part about these are the ones that start. Um, 
where you can't send in a cross on a corner. It's just a low driven ball no matter what you do. Legend plays 1428 says his bag at the next dick. And why is he a scam? I am new to the market, so well, I want to know. Ladies. Kinsey King 12 just resubscribed for 24 months. Nice. Two years. Kinsey, we missed you last night. It was like five in the morning for you. Uh, why is it a scam? Okay, so a manufactured investment is when someone buys a bunch of a card at minimum value. There's, there's multiple types of manufactured investments. One of the big ones uh, is right now, here's, here's what you see people do. They'll buy a bronze card, for example. Uh, they'll buy a hundred of a bronze card. They'll Photoshop that they sold it for some outrageous amount of money. And then it gets posted all over social. The value of the card starts to rise because people want to somehow get into the, the investment. And as the value of the card goes up, then you sell back all of the bronzes that you bought to the people who are attempting to get in on it. And then you have people who buy it. And as it continues to increase, they sell. So yeah, you can make coins on it, but it was never an investment to begin with. It was created and manufactured or there's price manipulation. People find the price manipulation and then they're presenting the fact after. So you cannot make fast money from that. It doesn't work. And if it was already at a million or 9 million coins, which is what the bullshit response was. Um, if it's at 9 million coins, it would take, it comes down in two hour allotments to come down. There's no sense in ever investing in a card that's already at 9 million coins that was manipulated. So the whole thing is bullshit from the beginning. It's at 25 K now in your region because it was bullshit to start with. And a bunch of uh, gullible people tried to invest in it because they wanted millions of coins. And now anybody who bought a hundred of them at a thousand when it first started can make 250,000 and they're thinking it's hysterical. That's what a manufactured investment is. Almost, I'd say 99% of the time, if someone shows that they made money off of a specific card, it's either too late to make money off of that card or it's, um, it was bullshit to begin with. And now they're trying to make money off that card. And I get, somehow I get tagged in these these fake schemes it just drives me nuts it's it's desperation people want coins people still fall for it Perez. 
There we go. Just need these three done. I want the first five. If I can do five national matches every day and stay on top of it, uh, I think I'll be I'll be fine. But I am so far behind in the versus matches. It's out of control. Someone was selling a FIFA mobile account for $20 on Discord. And his OVR was 128 and he had over 300 million coins. Uh, that's probably about what that account is worth. <laughs> I doubt that. That probably wasn't even a scam. That was actually an account. Yeah, it's uh it I, I'm I kinda like this event. I like the gambling aspect of it. I hate when it's just doing the same thing over and over again for the same exact rewards that everybody else is getting. And this one there's always a slight chance that you can get more every single time you do anything. And that's what's got me uh, still into it. Yeah, Dirt Diggler is awesome. Thakris21 says is that after you've watched 55,793 ads. It's so funny because we went from no ads in FIFA Mobile at all, no ads, no energy, to now we're trying to make up all the ad revenue that we didn't have at the beginning of the season in one go. We're good here. Larson is a beast. I I really don't ever test players or or do anything like that because it, it's been my experience over the last seven years of this game that the quality of players is always secondary to skill. And I, I like playing with specific players, but what is the odds here to pull Robertson? 100 and up is 1 in 15. Yeah, we're going with resources. Another Narsen. Uh, okay, first tier of national matches is done. Daily claim is finished. Introduction is complete. Around the world where I'm holding, I'm, I'm holding until Thursday's reset with new players. We'll wait for that. Um, let's 
skill showdown, national reward offers. I think that's probably what I got to do next is Shit. the hell. Um, what? Let's see. Where are you guys at in national heroes? Uh, as far as this second round towards the the player, that's the question. Um, I am completely behind. I am insanely behind on on my matches. I'm just curious where that. I only have 60k points in national Fact heroes. Chris that says you teasing Kinsey. Probably ha -ha. not. He off. thought you were going to rate them. No, we've got to do skill. We've got to do the the skill showdowns. Um, I mean, twenty eight tickets. God, twenty eight tickets, and it expires on Thursday. You're at 119,000. I don't even I don't even know where I'm at. It's the hope that kills. Okay, we're going to keep track today. I'll keep track of the uh, the wins and losses and see how far we can go. Kinsey King 12 says first time in the event I have all those skill showdown matches done. Seriously, I'm way behind. And that was an hour and a half last night playing matches. This is incredibly boring. The only excitement I have is when the match is over and you see if you got more than the minimum amount. 2000 is the most I've gotten with any win. Well, every day there are 13 available a day. Plus, if you come up away with tickets anywhere else. So in a week, you're talking about 191 matches to 100 matches, depending upon how many extra tickets you end up with. 1575. Okay, let's open packs. We'll play two matches and open a pack. That was a bust. Where are we at? How much do we have to get to the next? One more pack. Plus, you have five national matches every day on top of it. Is the mercy for legendaries it's 12 
sacred shards and then you're guaranteed a legendary and if that's the case I opened nine sacred shards on stream the other day all epics and I have three sacreds now and I can't remember I don't think I pulled a legend with the last one but this should be 12 right there So it's not guaranteed at 12, it's just a 2% after? That doesn't make any sense. Why did that not... What the hell did it do? Hit him in the face? So it's not guaranteed, it's just an increase in percentage. Oh well, shit. See, that's not the way I read it. Two hundred and twenty is a guaranteed legendary. We'll still open the sacreds I've got. It's a double ticket event. I only have three sacreds, but we opened nine the other night with nothing. I opened nine sacred shards the other night on stream, and we got absolutely nothing. Thirty-one twenty-five. We'll do this, which should unlock a player. 150,000. Who are we going to go with? We've got right mid Bala. Or we're going for a left back, obviously. Eighty thousand. Okay, 90,000 is to the next one. Yeah, you once once your clan boss team starts taking on the top 2 clan bosses, then you'll start getting a lot more shards.
That's where all the shards come from. You need to get on sooner and sooner before the raid combos start. What is going on? Is it the cord? What the hell? What the hell is going on? That was the strangest thing. The boar fest of FIFA and the excitement of Raid hard to contain. Yeah. See, then, then you get into these. Why? I wonder if I've got a bad cord. That's weird. I moved. It's got to be a bad cord. Bad cord or a bad connection. I really just want Keen. It's got to be a bad cord. Now it's like reconnecting for a backup. This is this is a new one, Norway. I don't pay much attention. I just kind of figure out who's got what skill move and then use um, my ball roll whenever it's somebody with heel to heel. Target 1575. Oh, we've actually unlocked a couple of these. 1775. 2275. We're close to another opening. Just so many of these matches.
You don't know. Welcome. All we need is the new raid content. <laughs> I'm trying. I am the uh, squeaky wheel right now. One twenty one Holland. Where's their one twenty one Holland? I'm not paying any attention. Goalkeeper rank item. Jesus, Pete. Sometimes it's not even worth doing it. 23 oh my god so many matches we'll do this for a little bit longer there's a 121 in versus or holland in in the team oh yeah it's striker I haven't paid attention. Oh, that should have been a goal. Now I have 40 plus tickets. That's what I had last night. I was over. I had 40. I think we have 45 tickets at the beginning of the stream. And I took it down to like 20. here to finish it there you go fifteen fifty again we're still stuck with these in the I don't think I've had higher than fifteen seventy five imagine account takeovers on FIFA and having to do all these matches no. No. This is bad enough. And I have to get them all done in the next two days or I can kiss the prime icon goodbye. I'm almost asleep now.
Ooh, I'm behind. What the hell's going on here? I'm behind. I need to focus up. Now I'm ahead. All right. Oh, it's Ty again. I'm ahead. It's Ty. I'm ahead. I'm really ahead. I think I got him. Ah, oh, that was an interesting, that was the most interesting match we've had. Um, okay, let's see. Credits. And rewards. over good grief how close are we to the next one one more one more to get there study for history test good luck We haven't lost yet. These are all wins. I said it too soon. Yet. What in the hell is going on? We can't even score a goal. That was the worst run of chances. Gonna be the lowest scoring versus match ever. I think we got him, but that was an awful match. Jesus, Holland has, he's a one, what is it, a 117? And his, his skill rating has got to be so freaking low. Jesus. You can't do anything other than heel to heel. One twenty one, yeah, can't do anything but heel to heel. Awful. Ninety. I got so many players I'm gonna have to figure out how to do it because I haven't even opened a store pack today because I'm out of space. Here, we'll try a three-star chop and see if he can do it or if it's just um, if it's just the uh, 
It's a heal to heal for everything. Okay, where's Holland? Where's Holland? I, I'm personally finding the Holland to be god awful. Ball roll is the only thing you can do with him. I don't care if he's a 105 or a 125 or what. It is he is an awful player to play with. me back my gold Austrian team uh oh I'm behind shit there went the momentum oh my god it's gone for both of us, though, it's even. I'm ahead now, finally. Jesus, that was the worst match ever. Everything he hit went in. Del Piero, that was a couple of seasons ago. Damn. First draw. All right, we'll do one more and open up one more pack. Still haven't lost a match today, but that draw is going to haunt me. Holland, you're awful. You can play them without looking. <laughs> uh, this team is so high rated, but God, they are awful. Yeah, Holland's skill moves are just next level bad. He he's barely has the the ability to even kind of equalize out his skill moves too. Three day milestone. What what three day milestone? Who'd we pull? 95 McCann. We have ads here. Ads I haven't watched yet. 10 to 10,000. I need heavy metal or something. 
I'll have to pull up some old some old royalty free because the band was never signed some music it'll be the the versus music How many was that? 20. All right, good numbers. Good numbers. Come on, I want good numbers. These ads drive me nuts. Is it doing it again? See if this one will even register. Let's see if it goes away and see if it was the cord. It shouldn't be a broken cord, it's a good USB C cable. It's actually brand new. See, I haven't even taken the little, the blue shit off of it yet. I don't know why, but it's definitely causing problems. All right, this is a different cord. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm trying to do the ad. I got one more ad to watch. All right. That was weird. It's like uh, it's receiving transmissions from space or something. Subliminals in the green screen. Another 20 points. Those are just annoying. Because they're not enough to really make a difference. Two. Ooh. These are the fun ones. Because it could be anything. Fifty world tokens. At least I got eight spins on the wheel for Thursday so far. Should have about ten spins. I, I might be able to come away with a few players on the wheel. All right, I could go one more. How many do we have? We're down to eighteen tickets. Jesus, so many freaking tickets. So many matches. Um, uh, all right. Yeah, the five keys sucks. What are you going to do with five national keys? And I've gotten it a few times. It's just, it's just not enough to do it. All right. You guys have spoken. We're going to switch over to the Pytheon build. Um, 
Oh wait, Kinsey doesn't want me to go to raid, so we're gonna play three more matches. Uh, we'll play three more matches. I was gonna, I was gonna end the FIFA Mobile and switch to raid, but apparently we got to make three more matches. It's a numbers thing. See, we'll just play. We'll play this match and then I'll be at 17, which is a prime number. So that's where we can end it. Holland is awful. Ah, oh, he's so bad. Now it's the other way around. It's like it's not what we want to grind. What we want to grind is something that changes every time. Like seasons, where there it's a different thing. This is just so monotonous, and you're not even using your own team. And the team you're using, you're playing against, like it cannot get any worse than this. The only thing that would be worse is if the entire team was all Hollands, even in the goal. And you were playing against an entire team of all Hollands, even in the goal. Okay, we won't end it on 17. Kinsey is adamant that we keep playing FIFA. It's it's just... It, ugh. And what's so funny about the whole thing is they, they're they just so blind to the problems that they don't, they don't understand what we're complaining about. You know, we were, here's, here's a perfect example. We were complaining about the exchanges. Okay. The argument was the exchanges because we don't have any exchanges. There's no way to get um, rid of all of these silvers and golds. There's just no, because we don't have squad building challenges and there's no exchanges in it. You can't do anything. And they're like, well, we've got exchanges. There's, there's two exchanges. You've got Nesta and you've got... Um, Verati and I'm like, well, Verati is non-auctionable, and he's no one's gonna do it because of all the requirements and the fact that he's non-auctionable. And Nesta has a zero percent chance of giving you anything more than a percentage of what you put in, so that they're not getting rid of any of the players. And their solution was, well, what if we make the next exchange auctionable? Like that's not going to help anything. That's not what we want. So then we get Larson, who's now auctionable, which does nothing. This might be a draw. Does he score or does he lose? Yes, he lost it. They just don't get it. They don't understand what the problems are. 
See, we need low OVR. My exact, my exact thing was we need three tiers of step up exchanges in the foundations. You need to be able to exchange, even if it was just 20 silvers for one gold and 20 golds for one elite, 20 elites for one uh, master, that would allow us to get rid of our low OVR cards and not feel like we're giving away stuff for 100 coins, not to mention how long it takes you to unlock each and every player. I said it, the only players that you should be that should be locked when you receive them are anything above like a 90. Even if we have to unlock all of the masters, that would be fine, but having to unlock every silver that you do who cares if a silver is locked? What are you going to accidentally recycle it? They just don't they don't understand the the small problems that have us all complaining about everything else. Jesus, that goal ball was not going in the net. Yo, boost exchange. I don't see him ever doing that. Oh, we just don't get to play. We just want the ability to get rid of players easier than we are. Is that down to 15? There. Kenzie, do you feel better? Better way to get training transfer points. Filter our players with a little red line on them. That would be cool. They're not going to do it, though. Not going to do it. All right. That's it. Uh, that's where we're going to we're going to leave this and switch over to raid just to give us um a full time to to build our python it's close it's close to where it is but you know actually i want to do this one time i want to do this one time let's see before we go to python how many players do I have? 1230. 1230. I've got to get 30 players before reset tomorrow. 30 players to move out. 30. 30 to move out before I can finish out the daily quests. God. That's uh, so annoying. It's just annoying. I was at like 1285 before the stream started. It's just all those little silvers and it just, they, they start piling up. It's annoying. All right. Um, that's where we'll end it for FIFA mobile today. Just quick sell the 30. Do you know how long that takes? You have to unlock each individual player. It's not quick. It's not a quick sell. It's a drag your fingers across broken glass. Take forever. Pull your brain out through your ear with a pair of tweezers. Mind numbingly slow. It's it's awful because you, you're giving stuff away for 100 coins, which just pisses you off because you're full and you're... You're doing it, but it's it's so slow to do it. And you, it takes like three steps, which just pisses you off even more. It'd be fine if I could just click on the player and say, quick sell, quick sell, quick sell, quick sell. 
Or like on console used to be where you could click 10 things and just dump all 10 at once. It's, it's just awful. Rank someone, you would train someone, which would cost hundreds of thousands, if not millions of coins. I'm pissed off about having to give stuff away for a hundred coins to me. I'm definitely going to train anybody and uh, spend coins to do it. No, it's just, it's just infuriating. It's frustrating and it's awful. And the 25, the 25 limit on the trans, the 25 transaction cap is even worse because I've got 30 players and right now I think I would be willing to bet I've got all transactions in I oh, know I've got three spots so I can actually try to sell some stuff but I can't dismiss anything it won't let me dismiss anything so if there's something in here that I need to re put in it won't let me put it back in to fix anything so the only choice you have is quick sell or sell three players at a time that are possible to be sold. So let's go down to 73. We'll see if there's any, even anything in here that's possible to be sold. I mean, maybe get rid of some of the low end gold oh, stuff. Gosh. Get rid of some of the low end gold stuff. So right there's one, two, three, four, five. I can get rid of those bottom five golds. There's one. One I can sell. Ooh. So exciting. We sold a player. Now they have 29. Oh my god, it just it's just so unbearably slow and if you come down to a point where you're at and you want to quick sell somebody let's say we're going to quick sell Olufsen got to unlock him then recycle him yep one at a time then come back down to him it's it's just too much too much. Is it hard for them to add that feature? Uh, okay. It's not. <sighs> yes, it is incredibly hard for EA and the dev team to add that feature because EA and the dev team do not have control of the game. It's not EA and the dev team making changes. The game was outsourced a year ago. So they don't have control. We're not playing an EA game. They are the they are the mediary between us and and the actual developers of the game, Nexon. That's why it's all different. It's not EA. It's Nexon. So like everything that we deal with with the dev team, they're they're like, we'll see what we can do. We'll try. But yeah, it's not until Nexon until EA gain control of the game again. It, it's it's not going to get any better. It's not going to get any better. And we've been dealing with it for all of 2022. And we're hoping that they eventually just the contract runs its course and they take control of the game again. It's awful. It's frustrating. Uh, mm, all right. So, Raid. We're moving over to Raid. That's where we're going to end it for FIFA Mobile. Stick around if you want to check out Pytheon. And uh, we'll be back for Raid tomorrow. 
hopefully a little earlier than we were on today. Uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. As long as you guys keep watching, I'll keep making videos.